All right, guys, we're doing the 28th hard request on the 2018 list. It is Hillary McRae, a song called Waiting. And let's take a listen to it here. part one lesson here. We'll do three lines for that, and then all of the lessons for this song are on my website, webpianoteacher.com. Works on all your phones, your tablets, your desktop computers, your laptops. Fast streaming for everyone. We'll put a little reverb and chorus on this, just because I like how that sounds. Yeah. All right, so we have F and D in the right hand to start with. <clears throat> And the left hand will start with E flat below middle C. And then left hand B flat. And then right hand B flat. And it's bum, 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 bum. Then we hit D and F in the right hand. And then da da da. F B flat D. It's a B flat chord. One, three, five. So the first measure is bum, 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 three, four. All right, second measure. Dun, 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 dun. Similar in rhythm. F and C together. In the right hand, left hand, I'll play a D. And then left hand, B flat, to a right hand, B flat. One, a two, ba. C and F there, so da, 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 da. All right, let's look at the next measure. So similar rhythm, D flat in the left hand now. D flat, right hand, F, B flat. So together, then left hand goes B flat to C. So left hand, B flat, right hand, C, ba, ba. And then E flat F C in the right, one, two, five. So bum, 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 bum. Just one, two, five with that. Then we go bum, 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 bum. So those last four notes left, then three in the right are fast. D flat in the left, right hand goes F C D flat. So dun, 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 dun three, four. And then one, two, da da da. So counts one and two are C in the left hand, F and C on the right. One, two, and really quickly, we'll just kind of roll this down. It's not really counted. It's just a, kind of a rolled chord going down. F, C to F, B flat together with one and two. Da -da -da. When you do that, when you end up on the F, B flat, the left hand will play a low C. Da -da -da. So that's kind of the first section of the intro. Let's do it again from the beginning and go. One, and two, and three, four. measure of course but there'll be a little vamping going on there's sometimes in this style of playing where the notes are played so soft you can barely hear them it's just kind of hanging out on the chord lots of empty spaces tend to play a little bit at the beginning and the rest of the measure is kind of held well since we're doing piano solo on this you probably need to play a little more than the recording has so I'm gonna vamp a little bit See, I'm playing a little more than what's up there, a little more than what's in the actual recording, but that's just going to help you in your in your piano solo if you're all by yourself because you don't have drums and and uh, other instruments with you. So F A D in the right, one two five. Then we'll go to B flat, then another B flat, -da -da -da. and then F at the end. Left hand's on G and D, and go. -da -da. Or sorry, it's a -da -da -da. so that's quick. A to B flat. Two to three. Da -dum. Okay, so the first measure. Da -dum. Bum, bum. Next measure is F, B flat. We're going to flip to G. Back to F. Left hand on an E flat. Octave, or you can put a B flat in there in the middle if you want. So this measure and then that one, and go. Next measure is very similar to the first one. So da, B flat, D, have those lines there because you're just kind of holding all those notes down. Let them mix together. So F, B flat, left hand on an E flat. So it's just really, you know, changing from one chord to the next uh, with not a whole lot going on rather than just vamping. 
next measure is like we've done with the, uh, although I have those flipped, those are not supposed to be that way. It's supposed to be G on the bottom. So let's fix that. Oops, too big. All right, let's get the G on the bottom. There we go, so it's a G minor seven, okay? There, and then you hear the prominent E flat there, so if a note's prominent, I'll put it, if it's just, you know, really soft, you can barely hear it on the recording, I'll, we'll just cover that with damp, with uh, vamping, okay? So, and go, that's where the singing starts. Three, four, back to G minor seven, back to E flat. Back to G minor seven, three, four. That one's a little bit different. B flat, C, and then you do the flip at the end. And I'm using, instead of just an E flat octave, I'm using the B flat in the middle just to give me a little more weight. Since I'm piano solo, back to the G minor seven, three, four. So, da, bum. there's the chorus. at that point um, <clears throat> but from this double bar to this one all you're doing is going back and forth between the G minor 7 to the E flat at 9 so E flat chord is like that 9 would be adding that F in there too okay if as long as you do those two chords you're, you're fine um, let's do all of that starting at that double bar and go Notice how I said three, four a lot because uh, probably when you guys start playing this, you're going to cheat the end of the measure and not give it enough time. So make sure you say three, four. Three, four. Three, four. Because counts one and two, you're, you're playing through and then it's kind of just a stretch to reach the end of the measure. Counts three and four. Don't cheat them. Okay, here's the chorus. <laughs> at that and that'll be the end of our, our part one so I gave you a rather extended part one here for this one E flat G B flat C one two three four on the right then I'm saving my fifth finger for the D left hands on a C octave three four dun, dun. you can vamp a little more on this section because it's a little a little more uh, you know a little more going on there dun, dun, dun. So this is C, F, A, B flat, one, two, four, five, left hand on an F. You go to B flat, F, B flat, left hand on your E flat octave with the B flat in the middle if you like. On the F chord, you can do F, C, F. Now right here, you're going to just pretty much play that chord two times. It's E flat, G, B flat, D, like that chord was, very similar. Left hand on a C, bah, bah, bah. then you're going to play F, B flat, left hand on G, D. There's your G minor 7 again. So Lots of 7s and ninths in these chords, which give us it, the sound that it has. Starting here, three, four. Uh, it's going to go C, F, A, B flat, left hand on F, and a D minor 7 at the end. C, F, A, left hand on a D. The measure finishes here. Just ran out of room over there. So this is really the, where we're going to stop. B flat, E flat, F, B flat, left hand on an E flat. Three, so the whole chorus starting here is...
so we will pick up right here in lesson two. Continue on with that. Hope you guys enjoyed that part one. Talk to you later.